Welcome to Groundhog Day 2012. Uh, we've just been out on the trail looking for Wilbur, the whistle pig, and uh, although we did not see Wilbur, we found some very suspicious tracks and signs out there. Had a great ski. We're back here gathering at the town trailhead. Got the bonfire going and some festivities, and the proclamation is going to be read here in just a few minutes. I have the proclamation in hand, which I will now read. Wilbur the Winthrop Whistle Pigs 2012 Winter Proclamation. In this month of February, on its second day of the year 2012, I come before you people of the Metow Valley to testify and proclaim what we have discerned from our furry friend and resident rodent, Wilbur the Winthrop Whistle Pig, regarding winter's future. From observers all up and down the valley, from as far as Moccasin Lake and Barnsley, to as close as Riverside Avenue, and indeed, this very place where we are gathered. The statistics have been gathered and scrutinized. Today, I am pleased to report that there were 58 observers who took part in tracking Wilbur. 58. I hear 59 observers tracking Wilbur today. And here is the proclamation. Clothed in winter's climb, we in Winthrop gather, for Wilbur the Winthrop whistle pigs matter. Having tracked on trails and skis or other tread, we group to hear human voice in Wilbur's stead. Some rejoice to hear that winter is fini. Others say, I have not yet begun to ski. But Wilbur is to be only what he can and predicts without care nor concern of man. So hear ye, hear ye, citizens of this valley, what Wilbur the Winthrop Whistlepig says to thee. It is now with great honor and in human voice, I am pleased to proclaim to you of Wilbur's choice. And here's what Wilbur says. I awoke this morning from my slumber, my den of sticks and snow covered lumber. Burrowed my way out without a splinter, no doubt to me, six more weeks of winter! Yeah! Six weeks of winter here in Winthrop, Washington. And the skiers are 